All right, here's today's uh, little project. This uh, Korg digital recorder, the D1600. I got this thing probably, I think it was either 2000 or 2001, somewhere around there. The thing's about 16, 17 years old, give or take. All right, um, now this has generic MIDI in it, and uh, this was meant to be slaved with another D1600 unit, and you were able to slave them together to make 32 tracks of recording with two machines and it had the old uh, general MIDI code to communicate with the other machine to turn certain things on and off at the same time. So uh, in my mix bus, my Harrison workstation, I have uh, generic MIDI capabilities for a uh, controller. So what I did was is I assigned the Korg, my external mixing here and it's controlling the door so now I don't have to click on a mouse and do everything one thing at a time which is time consuming and it uh, robs your workflow takes you forever to do things um, if you spend three hours a day on on a mouse clicking a mouse dragging dropping open up pop up pop up menus and you know whatever during the day this just saved me three hours time by uh manipulating this old general MIDI to uh, work with with this program um, so as you can see right now I just have a uh, basic MIDI function with the, the fader and here's my pan I'm assigning you have to teach it I have to uh, go into a command for it to learn and then uh, you know once it learns it, I'll save everything see right there there's my pan left and right Everything's, you know, they're working. So far I have five tracks done. I'm going to get a uh, template for 16. I'm, I'm just practicing. This isn't even my main rig. I'm going to use this for a MIDI controller on my main rig. This is just a little sidecar uh, input stage for whatever I'm working with. And I'm just getting familiar with it. I run uh, duplicate doors on, on three computers, actually. I have another computer that I use for certain things. And, uh... You know, I just, uh, Mixbus has an unlimited license. You can install it on, as long as you own the license, you can install it on whatever you need to install it on. Uh, you know, it's a great company. I encourage you. Uh, Harrison's been around before Reaper, before Florida, FL Works, whatever the hell they are. Uh, Ableton, Pro Tools. Uh, Harrison's been around since way back, and they made real equipment that was used, you know, in the outside world, analog equipment long before, uh, you know, digital recording existed. So uh, they're ahead of the game, actually, with their uh, digital audio workstation. But, uh, you know, this is what I'm doing. I just saved myself a ton of money because I was going to try and get a uh, MIDI controller. I just, I was going to go analog with a console and run...